All right, guys, let's wrap this up. Welcome back. Let's talk about how we first started off this app. So we started off by building a main component called app. We just used the basic default component. And we gave it a state of an empty array. So it starts off empty. And then after a request is made to get us back the information from the uh, JSON API, we use that to change the state and populate the people property with whatever came back. So pretty simple, right? Then what we did was we passed that data to a component called list through a prop called people. Okay, this people prop took the people, the this dot state dot people, and passed it to the list component. Now, what does our list component look like? Well, this is it right here. What we did is we took this dot props dot people and just called it people for the sake of brevity, and we're mapping over everything in this array. People is an array. So we mapped over and for each item we are returning uh, the the name of the character which was a property inside of that um, of that object. Let's go and check it out. You'll see right here. If I look here, there's a name object, there's a name property. So as you can see the name is Luke on the first one. The second one is C3PO, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. So we did that. And then what we did was we passed that item to character info so that we could use each individual object as its own little um, you know as its own little independent piece and basically take information from each one of them so we created this character info component and uh, what we did was we used whatever was passed down which was passed down as char info and we here right here we took char info from props and saved it as a variable called info and all we did was just display it so we just displayed basically uh, properties inside of that of that information that was passed down and what we did to to basically create this little open and close box was fairly straightforward we just created a couple little events one which opens the box and one which closes it and they change the state of this component which was expanded so as you can see expanded changes here and expanded changes here now it's important to differentiate between state and uh, excuse me between component and app state app state is what we had been passing down so we had been passing down people we passed down info here from people and then we, we use that info here but this has app state the state of this app uh, of this component excuse me oh I really messed that up the state of this component is that this is either open or closed this isn't related to this state to this data this is the state of this little component here open or closed has nothing to do with this state okay so hopefully you were able to make that distinction um, and yeah that's pretty much it very simple app and you know go ahead and try it out with a real API SoundCloud or YouTube or you know Imgur or something Okay, guys, that's it. Thank you for watching. If you guys want to take a break from writing code, please take a look at my other channel where I do uh, non-computer programming related stuff. I'll put a link in the description, and it'd be really cool if you checked it out or subscribed. I'm trying to get to 100 subscribers. So I will catch you guys in the next one. I hope it helped. Take care.